WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange has hit back at the new CIA director, Mike Pompeo, after he called for a crackdown on the whistleblowing group. Last week, Pompeo made his first speech in office and he had a few good words to say about Assange. WikiLeaks walks like a hostile intelligence service and talks like a hostile intelligence service. Ignorance or misplaced idealism is no longer an acceptable excuse for lionizing these demons. Not holding much back there, Paula Slea joins us live with more reaction. Hi Paula, how's Julian Assange responded then? Well, Julian Assange is one of the so-called demons, and he certainly has had his say in terms of what the new CIA chief said. He used his first speech in office largely to criticize extensively the WikiLeaks organization, and you have Julian Assange hitting back, saying that it is, it is, is it incorrect, I mean, that, that's putting it lightly, for the new CIA chief to suggest that WikiLeaks be stripped of First Amendment rights. In fact, he went even further, suggesting that the agency's modus operandi was was one of lying, was one of misdirection, saying that the organization should not have the opportunity to behave as an arbiter. Now, all of this comes parallel to WikiLeaks releasing and continuing to release a series of secret CIA files that point to how the organization operates, essentially uncover its techniques. What is particularly interesting is that this is not the first time that there have been these kind of threats against WikiLeaks. We certainly saw similar threats being made against Assange and his um, brain child by the previous administration and those threats went so far as to actually suggest to eliminate them. The United States do something to stop Mr. Assange. We're looking at that right now. He should be treated as an enemy combatant. WikiLeaks should be closed down permanently and decisively. This guy's a traitor, a treasonous, and, and, and he has broken every law of the United States. The guy ought to be, and I'm not for the death penalty, so if I'm not for the death penalty, I only want to do it, illegally shoot the son of a now, there had been high hopes that a new administration in office would mean a new administration and hence a new approach towards whistleblowers. But certainly we're not seeing this materialize. If anything, we're seeing this new CIA chief openly calling for WikiLeaks to be shut down. We have to recognize that we can no longer allow Assange and his colleagues the latitude to use free speech values against us. To give them the space to crush us with misappropriated secrets is a perversion of what our great constitution stands for. It ends now. Now, it's not clear at this stage how all of this is going to end. It is quite ironic that you have President Trump, who is making good on the threats of President Obama to strike in Syria. And so the question of the future fate of WikiLeaks is one that at this stage is up in the air. Yeah, tough times yet again for it. Paula, thanks for the update there from London.